You disgust me. I'm right. sick and tired of waiting on you to take control of the Jackie 08 campaign. There ain't no campaign. Right now we're doing worse than Fred Thompson in a Fox News poll. Oh, I'm thinking about shopping my wares to one of the campaigns that might appreciate me better. Okay. Like I just did a great new slogan for the Huckabee campaign. Right. Huckabee? Fuck me! Hey, watch your language. I ain't gonna hear that kind of talk. I don't wanna hear nothing like that. Good lord. Huck. No, you know, like you're reading the newspaper, you're like, I wonder who's coming in second in the Iowa polls. Right. Like, Huckabee? Fuck me! Hey, watch your language. Don't know want nobody here at He especially don't. That man ain't gonna pick it for a slogan. He's a preacher. He's a cool preacher, though, oh. Jackie. He's the kind of preacher who plays bass yeah. and shoots animals yeah. and loses weight. Yeah, he used to be real fat. Yeah. Not anymore. I see him on the news. He's talking to him. I was like, who is that good-looking son of a gun they talking to? Is that George Clooney? They're like, we'll be right back with Mike Huckabee. Yeah. I was like, Huckabee? Fuck me! Hey, watch your language. I ain't gonna listen to that no more. Good Lord. I will say yes, so You're right about that. All people seem to be warming up to old Mike Huckabee, yeah. Yeah, unless you need an abortion. Well, that's true, yeah. Huckabee says abortion's like a holocaust. A well, holocaust? What do you mean by that? They ain't just aborting Jewish babies, are they? Oh, and he's got the awesomest celebrity endorsements. Yeah, that's true, yeah. Old Walker, Texas Ranger, and that wrestler, old Ric Flair, yeah. Chuck Norris, Ric Flair, if he gets endorsements from Kid Rock, Vita Guerra, and Wolverine, he'll have endorsements from all my posters. Your posters? What the hell are you talking about? I, all these people liking Mike Huckabee need to remember back when he was Governor Arkansas, he wasn't no good Republican. He used to raise a bunch of taxes. Yes, sir. Well, Jackie, they all raise taxes and then they lie about it. Well, yeah, a preacher ought not be lying. Well, he probably shouldn't be running for president yeah. either. But he's an awesome preacher. He's yeah. the kind of preacher you'd see back in your hometown. Like in Murfreesboro, you'd run into him at the post office yeah. or the grocery store. He'd have a little joke for you. How's your mama doing? I don't think this country needs to be making small talk with a preacher for the next four years. He's the kind of preacher that you could call him up and he'd come bail you out of the drunk tank when your mama won't do it no more, yeah. and he'll give you a ride home, and he won't lecture you. Yeah. I mean, not about that, about like smoking and eating fast food and yeah. the fair tax or whatever the hell. And then take you back to his place to sober up. You sit around drinking tea and listening to him play bass, take off your fake leg, rub your nose. What? Take off your fake leg? What are you talking about? Oh, I'm sorry, that was what Heather Mills' life used to be like. Heather, what? Look, Jackie, you might as well get used to it. Huckabee is in it now, and yeah. uh, you know. He's likable. He's a likable, charming, kind of funny Southern ex-governor. Yeah, sounds like a Republican Jimmy Carter to me. No, I said kind of funny. What?